Cincinnati's certified most accurate forecast. Well, we're celebrating halfway day this afternoon. We are halfway through winter, 45 days down, 45 days to go, 60 days until opening day. And for those who have been thinking spring like and those warmer temperatures that we've been enjoying, it's really been a roller coaster because we had those warmer temperatures earlier this week, coupled with those spring like storms on Tuesday evening into Wednesday morning. And so, with that, we were talking runoff with the Ohio River a little swollen. Currently, the at last check, the obs observed river level was at 40 feet, just a little bit over. We're expected to crest Saturday afternoon at around 43 feet. Now, action stage is 40 feet. So, with the river being an action stage, we're looking at a little bit of flooding near Coney Island. It's not going to be flood stage along the banks, though, because flood stage is around 52 feet. We're expected to go below that action stage by Monday. So, that's the current check with the Ohio River. Other than that, we're looking at our temperatures falling, and it's feeling like February again. So, the spring is out the door, but it will come back just soon enough. We're looking at our future cast now, and you can see a little bit of a weak disturbance off to our north that's causing some flurry some flakes, especially in Indianapolis and in our easternmost communities. We've been seeing some this morning. High pressure, though, will be making its way in. And with that, a nice southerly breeze. We're looking at a warm-up as we head into the weekend. So for those who are just not ready to let go of those 50-degree temperatures, they're coming back. But then just like that, they'll be gone again by next week. So this winter weather roller coaster will continue. Again, flurries off to our west, a little bit of flakes as well. Taking a look, the lake effect snow machine off to our north. I want to take a closer look at our viewing area and what we've seen. Mostly just Fayette Union and Franklin counties in Indiana. They've seen some flakes, some flurries this morning. Taking a closer look, we did see on our camera out in Connorsville that they saw a little bit of a dusting on some of those grass. Your areas, but Connorsville, Fairview, Clifton, Liberty, and Roseburg, you've all seen a few flakes this morning and this afternoon. And again, those you can see are dissipating, so they won't be sticking around for much longer. Our temperatures, they've been a pretty, pretty cool, and they're going to stay cool this afternoon. Although we're in the 30s, it's going to feel like the 20s. So right now we're taking a look. Our temperatures, for the most part, staying in the low 30s, and we should top off in the mid 30s later on this afternoon. But again, the wind chill is something you need to factor in. So the winds out of the west at 12 miles an hour, feeling like 23 degrees. So it's very cool. You're going to want to bundle up. It's very different than what we've been feeling with the spring-like temperatures. It feels like winter again. Our clouds will be sticking around all day, starting to break apart later on this evening, and then the chill will start to settle in because there's no blanket of cloud cover to help hold in some of our heating today. We're going to drop all the way down to 20 degrees tonight, and it'll feel like the teens. So future cast showing again those clouds this afternoon, moving out later on this evening. Our timestamp 11. O'clock tonight. And then as we move into Friday, you can see gorgeous sunny skies. So as soon as we get through today and the clouds that we've been seeing all morning long, those break apart this evening. Sunshine for Friday, Saturday, and even Sunday, and also warmer temperatures. So today, 35 degrees, cloudy and breezy, winds out of the west. Overnight tonight, dropping down to 20 degrees. Clearing means it's going to be a lot cooler. And then as we head into Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, look at the sunshine. Full blast, and those temperatures making their way all the way back up to 50 by Sunday. And then we're back to February by next week.